Hey guys, this is Chico with He Provides Homestead. We're not on the homestead today. We are in Fairfield, Ohio, which is just a little north of Cincinnati. We are at Jungle Gems International Market, and I'll list the uh, I'll give you the link to their website in the description box below. Um, this is the coolest place. It's a 285,000 square foot international market. Tell me what they got everything. And I won't stumble through I tell you what. We're going to show you what. Um, it covers six and a half acres. Um, and it started out as a fruit stand in 1974. And it's phenomenally large. It's one of the coolest places we've ever been. And they've actually got two stores now. We've never been to the one on the east side, but we love this one. It's so kitschy and cool and, and has a carnival feel to it. It is just great. Um, but some of the things that I do want to share with you, they've got a huge cheese section. They've got a huge hot sauce section um, and fresh made sushi. They make it right in front of me. So that'll probably be on my menu today. Um, my wife and I are both going to shoot video. We're probably both going to be on this side of the camera. Here, let me let me explain that better. We are probably going to both be on both sides of the camera during this video. So we're getting ready to go inside. Um, we'll come in and out and show you cool stuff. We don't want to bore you because we'll probably be here for hours. But we'll be on and out, and we'll check back in a little bit. Hey guys, we came upon the honey section. Very cool. It's the most honey I've ever seen in one spot. We would just want to show you a little bit about it. They've got different kinds. They've got orange blossom, wildflower, clover, buckwheat honey. Um, what else? Do we have? Clover, a lot of clover honey. They have them in the little bears. There are some people who get paid Check this out. You know, we've already met a Blueberry blossom honey. Somebody can just have fun. Hi, my name is Lisa. Uh, I'm from Baltimore, Colorado. And some people might say, well, it's just run on and I can see I got started in beekeeping about four years ago. And the reason I did is because the colonies in my honey. garden have fruit trees and it has fruit honey. I love honey. I use honey really almost every day. The one thing I've learned about bees is really they don't put bother you. They don't bother you. The bees uh, come around. I uh, put uh, honey in, in, in my oatmeal. Um, we use honey for a lot of stuff. So I don't want to show you every jar. But just check it out. Uh, check these out. Made in the USA. Save the bees. Made from organic cotton. Just thought that was cool. Uh, check this out. Pure honey with the comb. We will likely take something home from the honey section. Um, there we go. Can you see that deer? Um, what else? Tangerine. There's some cream honey. I've never had that. That might be what we buy today. Um, what else? Beeswax. Oh, very cool. Yeah. What do you, you use beeswax? Don't I you do. Hear? We use the beeswax for lip balm. Check this out. Don Pops Honey Farm. Five pounds of honey. Love honey. Um, Twenty-nine bucks. Not bad. Pull it down. I know they've got it because there it is. Oh, this is probably <laughs> in the wrong section. Um, spike lavender, but we know now that they have it. So cool. Uh, honey candy. Cranberry bog honey. Oh. There you go. Wisconsin. And we're in Ohio. There's Ohio honey. So Oh, look, we've actually, we bought this, some of this, this very honey when we were in Tennessee last October. Um, you will likely buy some more. My father-in-law loved it. So, um, just pan around here and show them this section here. Um, this is all the maple syrup. This is all maple syrup all the way down. See the great big jugs at the bottom? Very cool. So, thought this was very cool. Thought you'd like it. We'll be back. Hey guys, 
wanted to show you the herb and jungle section. It is very cool. Um, my wife is checking for yarrow or arrowroot. I, I can't remember. Arrowroot, I think. But one of the two to make um, deodorant with. Um, so I, just, I thought I'd show it to you. It's very cool. We're going to go in and look. Um, and I just found out that Jungle Gems has the largest gluten free um, section in the Midwest. Um, and I'm just finding out lately that gluten may be a big culprit in the pain issues that I'm dealing with. So, um, we're going to go ahead and check it out. Um, essential oils, soaps, um, looks like whey and protein products, vitamins, herbs, supplements. Um, and there's my wife at the end. I think she may have found something she's interested in. So, very cool herb. What is it? Herb and jungle. Very cool. So, we'll be back. All right, guys. We're, this is a, a cool little section. This section, come with me, is just pollen products. They've got six-pack waffles. Looks pretty cool. Not for me. Um, I don't even know. Different kinds of jams. But the thing that I thought was really cool is right here. Oh, how cute. Yeah, see, I knew she would say that. <laughs> and you know what? These would fit my wife. How cool are these? Made in Holland. Um, the last time we were here with our kids, they had these Dutch hats that were very cool. Um, but there's several sections like this. And if you want to scan around sure. here, just give them a, an idea. There's several sections like this. There's Holland, there's Ireland, there's France. Um, and we'll show you more as we go along. Just thought it was, you'd like how they've got little sections that are tied to a specific country. Um, yeah, very cool. We'll talk to you in a bit. Alright guys, we're in the France section. Um, some very cool stuff in this. We skipped over the Ireland section, not a lot of products. And there's lots of others that we'll skip over. But this French section is pretty cool. Um, Black Currant Dijon Mustard. Um, tell me when you Ooh, can see that good. Yeah, it's pretty. Yeah, that looks delish. And it is $3.99. Um, they have the Provincial Dijon. They have Tarragon Dijon. Uh, good looking. And there were some other items I wanted to show you right here. Chestnuts. Chestnuts. Peeled and cooked. Mm, that's right I, up your alley. I'm, I'm actually pretty interested in these. Um, here's a different brand. Rolling chestnuts. Um, looks mighty tasty. A lot of good stuff in this section. Um, Preserves. Yeah. Sparkling drinks. Um, check these out. The bottles are just very cool. Pink lemonade, yeah. naturally flavored. Got the cool top. So, again, we'll be back. Alright, I wanted to show you. Um, there's the Spain section. Um, there is the Scandinavian section, um, Greece, kosher products, um, let's bop into the Greece section real quick, um, stuffed vine leaves, um, what do we have? I don't know, I can't read Greece. Grecian or Greek smoked herring fillets. I love smoked herring. Um, very, very cool. A lot of pasta. A lot of, ooh, more honey. Pure Greek honey. Wild flora and thyme. Yeah, check this out. How, how sweet is that? So, I just wanted to show you that there are several sections like this. Um, and there are other bigger sections like the Gigante section. That's like several, that's like some South American and Spain kind of 
kind of mix. Um, they've got like foods. Um, and we'll get to the produce and stuff in a little bit. But I thought you would find it very cool, or at least I did, that they have little, little sections for different countries. So, very cool. We'll be back. Alright guys, we're not even a third of the way through the store, but I thought the stoplight was very cool. And, you know, they probably need it. There, I've seen several traffic jams already. But if you look, there's an Asian section. Um, there is a rice section. There is an Italian section. Um, ah, there's a Hispanic section. There's East Europe. There is something I can't read in India. Um, and we'll bring you more. Bye. Folks, I had to show you this. That is a fire truck. And it is sitting on top of a hot sauce display. Um, there are two aisles of nothing but hot sauce and hot sauce related stuff. Um, but there's some other cool stuff inside. Okay, yeah. I had to show you this. You had me at bacon. Now, if Chico ever needed a shirt, it's this one. That's a good shirt, guys. And also, bacon scented mustaches. Does it get any better? I think not. I think that might be a deadly thing for some. <laughs> Um, but check out the pepper section, just dried peppers, all kinds, mm -hmm. California chili, um, chili puya, puya, um, all kinds, most of them I can't even name, check that out, peppers, 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 dry rubs, dry rubs, um, and gotcha. let me show you Walking Dead Bloody Mary mix. But there's one section of it. There's all the hot sauces right here. More hot sauce. And I think there, are, if I remember right, it's been a while since we've been here. But there is some sauce. Yeah. There's another section that you have to sign a waiver to buy, it's so hot. Anyway, how cool is it that there's a display with a real fire truck on top of it? We'll be back. All right, guys, we are in the Great Britain section. And how cool is that? A tree above a display. And there's my lovely wife. We'll see what she's got to show you. Check it out. I'm thinking that that is probably Little John. Um, check it out. I'm telling you guys, coolest store I have ever seen. Um, we'll go over to the live harvest in a minute. Let's see what my wife has found. Okay, so anybody that knows me knows I have a sweet tooth. This whole aisle right here, back just a little bit, is nothing but uh, nothing but chocolate, caramels, and soft drinks, which is, I know it's not good for you, but it's so good. So they've got all kinds of chocolates um, here, players with um, caramel and nuts. Check out these drinks, guys, on the down here. It's all candy. Tizer. Tango. And then there's all kinds, which I don't know. I don't know if Great Britain has Jack Daniels, but there's Tennessee whiskey fudge caramels. And then these I'm really interested in: Scottish toffee. Sounds good, guys. We're gonna. This is the Great Britain section. Um, we will see what else we found. Check this out: Hayward's medium and tangy traditional onions. Might be good. Pickled sliced beetroot. Mmm, maybe not. Talk to you in a bit. Hey guys, lost my wife in the tea section. I'm sure she'll catch up. But these 
are so amazingly cool. Check these out. These are wine bottle holder sculptures. They are incredible. Such great craftsmanship. Um, they have all kinds. I don't want to pick them up. Um, they're a bit pricey. Um, at 90 bucks a pop. But check it out. There's a, like a sea captain. Um, I'll, I'll pick one up. No, I ain't going to. Check that one out. Aren't that cool? 90 bucks, a little out of my reach, but very cool, very artsy. Um, but like I say, out of my reach. Found my wife. <laughs> so we'll get back at it. All right, guys, my favorite section. Um, it's the produce section. Um, it's huge, it's loud, and there's produce from everywhere. My wife's going to can real quick to show you just how huge it is. Now check this out. See, we're not only here for the cool stuff, we're also here, since we're in the area, we're gonna buy for ourselves. They have a reduced section. This reduced section is bigger than some of the entire produce sections of other stores we shop at. Four colored bell peppers for $2.49. Three zucchinis for $91. Three squash for $78. Two packs of organic colored carrots for $2.49. Buck 27 for four yellow tomatoes. We got these are buck 49 a piece. Cheap. Almost a pound of mushrooms for buck 33. Poblano peppers for buck 24. I'm gonna do some produce cooking in the next few days. Um, we're not going to take you down every aisle and show you every item, but we will bring you back when we find really cool stuff. Um, got some cool stuff here. Wife well, didn't think it was cool, but I think it's cool. You tell me what you think. Um, we're not going to buy all this, but we are going to buy some of it. Um, zebra tarantulas. <laughs> Sounds yummy. Chocolate covered grasshopper. Black ant eggs. Sounds yummy. Would you try it? Louisiana style Cajun alligator. I've had alligator a few times. I like it. Rattlesnake. Smoked rattlesnake. I've actually had rattlesnake a time or two. It's really good too. Uh, but here is the piece of the resistance. Bacon and cheese flavored crickets. Sour cream and onion crickets. And cheddar cheese larvette. The original worm snack. Now here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna buy some of these items and we're gonna do a video uh, uh, by itself of just me trying these. And if my wife's shaking her head no, I'm gonna try to get her to try them, but it's likely just gonna be me. So we're gonna get a mix of these. We'll do another video of just me eating bugs. Talk to you in a minute. Guys, this is one of the coolest sections in the store. I think I've told you how much I love sea cream. Um, how fresh is this? Catfish, fresh. We've also got fresh lobster. And last time we were here, they had bluegill and bass. Um, and there's some fish in here that I'm not sure what they are. Um, I think that's striped bass, but I'm not certain. So, and we're going to show you this shut off, and we're going to show you the fresh um, one ice fish right around the corner. Oh, really. uh, there you go, folks. They do have um, live largemouth bass. $13.99 a pound. Um, they had striped bass on the other side, too. Um, let me show you this fresh meat section here. They have got 
everything, guys. They have um, Groper, Grouper, I'm sorry, Snapper, um, Bonita, Yellow Perch, Tilapia, Snapper, um, King Mackerel, Walleye, ooh, I love Walleye, um, tons. They've also got um, salmon, um, lobster, crab legs. Um, they've got live lobster. Great place. Busy place. So I'm kind of trying to avoid the traffic. Um, but it's a hugely busy place. We'll check that out. Folks, it doesn't get any whole black tilapia. $4.99 a pound. That is pretty, pretty fresh. Check that out. Skate wing. Check out the shrimp. Eel, shrimp, um, squid, smelt, octopus, clams, oysters, um, mussels, great stuff. Fresh slide mussels, $2.99 a pound. Love this section. We'll be back. Hey guys, we're going to wrap this up. 285,000 square feet and we've covered maybe a hundred thousand but here's the deal both the camera and my body are running out of energy they've still got a huge cheese section massive wine section um, cigar section they've got a massive meat section that has stuff like bison lion kangaroo alligator um, all kinds of all manner of unique exotic meats. Ostrich. I was going to look at some ostrich, but I'm kind of I'm running out of uh, energy, so is the camera. So we're going to wrap this up. Um, we hope that you like this tour. We'll come back another day and maybe get the other sections. Um, so please like, share, and subscribe, and just know that you can find us here on YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook, and we'll link up Jungle Gems website in the uh, in the section below. That's cool.